hello everyone welcome back and today i'm making a part two in my series of reading the narcissist's mind i'm really excited to do these videos because these are things that i've seen on my own and i'm sure that you've seen things that the narcissist does that are just not quite right and these are things that luckily I've actually found an explanation for and I'm sharing them with you. So what I'm focusing on in this video is a thing called saccades. So a saccade is a quick simultaneous movement of both eyes between two or more phases of fixation in the same direction. And in normal saccade movements, the eyes move smoothly and in abnormal saccade movements, it appears that the eyes jump. So the reason I'm bringing this up is because I had noticed abnormal eye movements or very rapid back and forth eye movements in people that I know personally that I believe are personality disordered. And oddly enough, <laughs> oddly enough, there is a family pet that is a dog and the dog has um, personality um, like behavioral issues and this dog actually has this um, eye movement um, characteristic that I'm going to be describing. I'm linking an article to a study below and this is from the National Library of Medicine.gov. And per the article, abnormalities in saccades can be seen in a variety of disorders. Therefore, saccadic eye movement is a sensitive instrument in analyzing some psychopathologies. So you can pretty much assume that if someone exhibits these jerky eye movements, then they most likely could be suffering from a mental disorder and possibly one that is going to be harmful to you. Of course, this is not a one-size-fits-all thing here. I believe that some people are born with muscular disorders of their eyes and they may exhibit these saccades, but this is a good tool if you believe someone is mentally disordered to just sort of confirm your beliefs because this is extremely interesting. And I'm also linking a YouTube video when I was doing research for this video, I also did come across other videos that I can't find right now um, that you can look up where people are actually examining schizophrenic patients. There's a lot of schizophrenic saccade disorder videos out there. And of course, um, not all schizophrenics are going to want to harm you. The bigger issue that I'm focusing on here is the narcissistic personality traits. And I do believe that these studies regarding abnormal saccades can definitely be applied to people with narcissistic personality disorder. And as you know, narcissistic personality disorder can also be comorbid with a variety of many other psychiatric disorders. So when I witnessed these um, rapid eye movements back and forth, basically I've noticed the person, they're usually right in front of me and their eyes are just going rapidly back and forth from right to left. And if you actually try to do this, it's difficult, if not impossible, which it should be impossible for a quote unquote normal person without any psychiatric illnesses to actually do. So just the fact that this is present in certain people really indicates that there is a brain disorder. And a saccade is supposed to be basically a visual tracking um, pattern where you might look up and you might see a bird flying across the sky. So a normal person is going to look at the bird and they're going to have a very smooth eye movement. But someone with abnormal saccades, they're not going to be able to follow that bird's flight with smooth movement. They're going to have involuntary jerks in their eye. So their eyes are going to look like they're um, just shaking or jerking back and forth. So that's basically what um, this video is about. 
And I thought it was pretty interesting. There's tons of great information out there for you to research. So pay attention. Um, next time that you meet someone or you have suspicions about someone, watch their eyes and see if they dart back and forth very fast. And I'll end the video here. I wanted to make this a short video because I feel like this is a very interesting topic that can stand alone. And I will see you in the next video.